Hi, I'm Sinner Asina and welcome back to Slate the Spire Ascension Weekends. This is episode 30 right now, so let's start. Okay, Ascension 10. Sorry. Now we start with a curse. I think this is my fifth or sixth of them, I already forgot. Meal ticket is fine. Extra recovery when we get to the uh, shops. Uh, but yeah, uh, been having pretty shitty luck so far. And I'm not gonna lie to you, I've been kind of tempted to sometimes, you know, just uh, say, screw it, I'm gonna, you know, save and quit and, you know, save, save scum. But no, as you know, these episodes are, you know, no no saves coming. Just we, we start and we finish without, you know, repeating any a single battle. Mm, footwork. Uh, do I want a ship deck? Do I want footwork? I want footwork. I mean, if I don't kill him, yeah. It's gonna be worse. Okay, he's almost dead. There. Well, you're not giving me too much of an option, are you? <laughs> it's like, hey, which kind of cards do you want? Do you want weak and poison? Do you want single poison or do you want double poison? <laughs> it's like, oh, geez, I don't know. I was like, wait a minute, why do I have plus two defense and then I remember the power, of course. Excuse me a second. <coughs> you know, just sneezing. Oh my god, I'm so glad I took that card. Mm. No, not for now. I'll throw that stupid fat goblin. Uh. And of course, I get the card right away. Yeah, I just die already. Like, I don't even mind this one that gets aggressive. I just dislike the fat goblin. And, not, uh, and it's not because he's fat, that's just an extra. <laughs> there we go. Uh, let's see, expertise, dagger throw. No. Okay, now what do we want? Let's see. Well, that's the route I want to take, so... 
I could go to a resting site and skip an elite, but no, let's take the question mark. Okay, well, I'm not planning on visiting any shops soon. I have three potions, so I'm just hoping for the best. I was like, mm, maybe I should use food worth bef uh, before, but then I told myself like, ah, you know what? Nah, I fine. Uh, but at least we get some free defenses and free attacks. So. Okay, we are fine. We are just confused. Well, our hand was confused. Now it's back to normal. You have to be fucking kidding me. Well, they say I only lose one of the armors. But I already used my three potions. Oh, and they are still randomized. Oh, of course they are still randomized. I mean, at least that one is free. And as long as I can get a single defense. Oh, wait, no, because they are not like, oh, boy. I should have gone for the block. What am I doing? I'm so glad that wasn't, you know, the turn he's attacking. Okay, come on, just give me, yes, a strike, thank you, let's go. Let's sleep. Now I really need a shop. Okay, let us not forget, we still have the Oricalcom, so... Come on! Okay, uh, that hits for eight and the weak. 
I'm considering my options, okay? Come on, give me two strikes, come on, three strikes! I guess this works. Maybe I should go to the shop to recover. Hey, the potions were nice. Okay, this battle may take a while, so regain. Mm. If I use crippling poison, they are gonna attack me for eight. I can't. Oh, wait, I have Dury Calcum. What am I saying? I just lost uh, two, but, you know, I recovered five, so I recovered three, actually. See, that wasn't so bad. Mm, too bad I don't get to record more HP, but that's fine. Who's the boss again? This line boss. This is the first time I get this line boss. I got a bunch of hexagos and one time the other guy. But no slime boss. That is not what I was waiting for from a question mark. Okay, let's see, 67, the half will be 33 or 34. If I attack again, he's gonna split, and I don't want that, we don't want that. Next, and now he's gonna split for sure. That's the best I could do. Thank you, Poison. Oh man, oh man, oh man. I didn't want to use the cultist potion. Now I'm gonna lose 8. At least I'm gonna record 15 when I enter the shop, but still. I was about to press the question mark. Oh, it's apotheosis! And I can even buy the potion belt too. Or the singing bowl. Well, wait, wait. That's 340, 428. Damn it! I cannot buy it both. Well, apotheosis is apotheosis, so... You know, you guys know I never said no to an apotheosis. You know what? I'm just gonna rest. And just hope that I get apotheosis on the first turn. No luck. Come on, apotheosis. Turn two apotheosis. No, no luck. Well, I can use this to, you know, weaken him for the slime crush. Of course.
Okay, let's see. If I take 10 more, so any of these attacks. So let's all let's use all of them. Oh yeah. <laughs> That's kind of funny. There we go. Well, it was thanks to that cultist potion that we're still here, so... Let's all say thanks. Thanks, cultist potion. Hmm, it's an echo eye. I mean, most of my cards don't go zero, but I have adrenaline, terror... And neutralize. Yeah, let's go for the slaver scholar. I don't have like high cost cards that need to be randomized, like with the ironclad. Okay, the collector. Now let's look for those question marks. Mm, I, I think I found a good spot. Yeah, let's not get cocky. We have to conserve as much HP as we can. Uh, terrible hand, but at least next turn we're gonna get strikes and neutralize. Hey, that works for me. Mm. Well, I have no way of defending myself aside from the Oricalcum, so I'm gonna lose 12. There we go. And still, only one attack card? I just got lucky on that one. I mean, a skewer could be good. Especially with the Slaver Scholar. I really need to upgrade Apotheosis. Come on, give me the good cards. Although in this particular deck, I don't know which ones are the good cards. Hmm, that's just 45. Uh, I should have, you know, used it on the other one. Ah, there we go. I lost a lot of HP. Yeah, reading is for chumps. Let's continue. No need to use the fence cars. We have Yuri Calcum. Okay, here we go. Wait, I have an idea. Let's kill this one. And then use adrenaline. 
There we go. Hey, that worked. This is what we call synergy. Oh, come on. Just food work. Well, drink this. At least I'm only going to lose 12. Instead of 18 or 24. So I reduce it to half. Okay, just give me the skewer. Those aren't the skewers. Mm, well, I have no defenses, so... I'm gonna lose 12. Again. So I ended up losing 24 anyways. Okay, sure. Um, well, I can ignore... Yeah, let's ignore it. Uh, I can ignore the elites and just take the safe route. Hmm, transform a card. Do I want to transform something, something I don't like, or... I mean, the upgrades and defense are already upgraded, so... Eh, I guess I could do without a strike, to be honest. Eh, it's fine. Okay, let's finally smit the apotheosis. Because as useful as it is, it's not a miracle worker. Okay, ninja scroll is fine. Okay, I'm gonna... Oof. Not the best combination of cards. Okay, good. Like, that Oricalcom is just, like, saving my life each turn. Okay, wait. Just die already. I don't need to do uh, to make my deck bigger. Eh, another neutralize. Yeah, sure. Why not? Ooh, yes, I want that. Gimme, 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 gimme. Oh damn. Okay, good, 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 good. Thank you. Yeah, I I'm gonna pick the show, but we need to recover that HP. You are almost dead. I'm doing great. Nominally speaking. Okay, I'm just gonna lose two. That's fine. Oh, I could have used the... Oh, well. Yeah, you're dead anyways. Oh, wait, you are poisoned. There we go. That one wasn't so bad. Okay, gimme, gimme, gimme. Thank you. 
Mm, a start with a power. Eh, I don't really need to start with footwork, to be honest. I, I would have preferred if it was lighting in a bottle to start with apotheosis always. Although the phantograph, on the other hand... Should I remove a, a defense? I have survivor... And well, I have finesse, but that, that doesn't count as a defensive card. It's just that the plus two defense is, is just a bonus, not really like the main effect or something you should be looking for on that particular card. Well, we don't have the strike dummy, so sweep strike is a no go. Hmm, maybe a strength potion or a skill potion. Or maybe I can just keep the money. But no, 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 you know what? Let's go for the strength potion. Call it a hunch. Oh, wait, I already have... Oh, damn it. Since I have defense, the, the Oricalcum is not going to activate. I could use the ghost in a jar, but I'd rather leave that for the boss. Besides, the Phantograph is going to recover us some HP. Okay, let's uh, use this, that, some of this. Ooh, so close. Maybe I should have used the strength potion on you. Uh, I don't want to lose that. Okay, let's see. Usually we recover about like 21 on the, on the resting side. Plus 25, that's 46. I'm going to lose 14... That's going to leave me with 18 plus 46, 56, 64 or something. Yeah, yeah, I think we're fine. Oh, the Oricalcum. Okay, well, that makes my issue a non-issue. Mm, Cloudtrops or Glass Knife? I mean, the Caltrop is already upgraded, so... Yeah, 21. Good thing I have a good memory when it when it's convenient for me. Oh yeah, that that ooh, that worked pretty well. And I get the best cards right away. Well, except for Crippling Cloud, but that doesn't matter. Ah, uh, you know what? I forgot to use this. Okay, let's see what happens. Okay, he's gonna summon more. Well, I could go for a skewer, despite the fact that I'm a little weakened. Hmm, damn it. I would have preferred that for the next turn. 
but it's whatever. I mean, at least I'm damaging him, which is, you know, the important part. Okay, that's oof, that's a lot of damage still, so time for this. See, what did I tell you about having the two neutralizers? Oh, I wasn't planning on attacking that minion. I mean, at least I can kill it. But I wasn't planning to. Okay, okay. Okay, I think we can do it. Yeah. There we go. And this is actually the first time I make it to the, I made it to the third floor. Hmm, burst. Uh, burst. What do we want to burst? I mean, double adrenaline or double finesse? Double terror? No. But aside from that, the defense cars? I don't know. As for the ships, well, we don't, you know, this is not a ship strategy. I don't know what kind of a strategy this is. I guess you could call it an apotheosis strategy. And tools of the trade. Hmm. You know what? I'm going to take tools of the trade. It's going to sound weird, but sometimes it's what we need. Ooh. Okay, I have a good feeling about this run. The sacred bar has never let us down. Oh, and I and as I say that, it's the awakened one. Uh, how many powers do we have? One, two, three, and now four. Oh boy. Okay, let's start here. Yeah, for example, if we use to stop the trade against enemies like this, when we get a burn, we can just discard it. Uh, maybe we can kill it this turn? Maybe. Hmm, 15 times 4, that's 60. Hmm, but we don't have a card that hits for more. Yeah, this is my... A strongest hitting card. Just die already. Duplication potion, pretty good. Well laid plans. I mean, well, against the awakened one wouldn't be that bad of a option. Since we don't have the running pyramid, it's a little, you know, annoying to use, but whatever. Oh, uh, actually, yeah. With this thing, maybe we can get something good out of it. No, no relics for me. I mean, I could forsake the madness or the well laid plans. I don't want to forsake the dagger spray, especially not with what's coming, but I'm going to have to.
Oh, of course it's the spiky enemy. Why wouldn't it be? Remember, all the enemies are annoying on their own way. But the spiky enemy is the worst of them all. Like, there's no competition. Because it just keeps getting, you know, more, more thorny with each turn. I could even just use the smoke bomb and call it a day. Okay, let's discard this. I not. Oh, okay. I, I was thinking on the gambling chip. Uh, okay, let's use. Wait. Much better. Let's use this. I cannot really hit it. Because that's a lot of damage. So I'm gonna kill the other one. Let's use this first. Now let's kill him. And let's just let the poison, you know, do its thing. Uh, blur, I mean, with well laid plans, I could set a good defensive strategy there. Speaking of... Actually, yeah, let's use Blessing on the fo of the Forge. That's not bad. Like, if I really wanted to... Okay, let's weaken them. Because I don't like them. Now, after... Remember what we learned last time? After they used their, you know, most aggressive attack, they just self-destruct. We could even escape. I mean... Let's see if we can survive this particular situation. If I use the duplication potion, which I don't want to, we can get 22, 33 defense, which would barely defend me against this one. And I don't have a way to... Yeah, yeah, let's escape. I don't like using escape potion, but... <laughs> it was an emergency. This is worse. <laughs> This is way worse. Okay, let's... Uh... Okay, we don't want that. That's fine. We can defend from that. Yeah, I'm gonna let the Oricalco, Oricalcom do its thing. Okay. Not good. That's a slightly better, but still. Okay, yeah. Yeah, 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 okay. Now I can breathe. Just breathe. Okay. 
This is what I get from for getting greedy. Okay. That's fine. Now that we have the apotheosis, we have a fighting chance, but still. Uh... Okay. Yeah, this enemy is like extremely delicate. You have to be on the top of your game if you don't want to get fucked. Okay. Okay, I'm fine. I'm fine. This is fine. See? This is fine. See, we are having fun. This enemy is taking more time than a boss. Okay, that's fine. Okay, one more turn and he's done. Thank God. At least we didn't have to use the duplication potion to save our asses. Mm. But we don't have to rest to save our asses. Okay, now let's see. If I go here, I could go to a shop. Or take on Elite, or I could go, like, to a resting side, and then maybe a question mark or an Elite. I don't have confidence in my deck against the Elites, but maybe against the, the boss, we can do it. Like, I want to go to a shop, but it's almost impossible. I will have to go through an enemy. Nah, screw it. Ah, the Darklings. Yeah, Darklings. You thought I was joking, but no, that's their name. They are the Darklings. Ow, oh, come on. I took a risk and lost. Uh. Okay, uh, well, the footwork. I can kill one of them. Yeah, okay, Yorikalkum, you go. Your turn.
Okay, that's 15. If I use the duplication potion, I can kill it. But you know I don't want to do that. Oh, wait. he's Yeah, he's going to kill himself because of the... Oh, thank you. Thank you, Caltrops. Thank you. Ah, die, die, die. Very useful against the boss. Okay, let's record some HP. Oh, this waffle. Oh. Uh, it's like the gods descended from heaven. Also, the fairy in a bottle. Okay, now I feel extra confident that we're going to defeat the boss. Uh, hmm. Now, do I want four dexterity or do I want four attack? If I start with plus four attack, my ships are gonna hit for. 8 instead of hitting 4, you know, 4. Uh, yeah, let's go for the strength potion because I still have the defense potion, so I'm kind of confident. Okay. Good. Hmm, mind blast. But I have. Yeah, it only hit for like 25. Discovery. Yeah, sure. Huh. Flash of a steel. Why not? Hey, that wasn't so bad. Okay. Yeah, sure. I can handle this guy. I think. I hope. Okay, let's... Uh... I mean, I could use a strike. If I use Crippling Cloud, he's gonna hit for 21. But then he's gonna get weakened. 25% of 21 is like... Five. So he's gonna hit for like 15 or 16. But then my Oricalcum is gonna activate. Okay, yeah, yeah. I, I think I can. That's fine. Auto, now that we have less cars, I'm starting to worry a little. Okay, I'm starting to worry a lot. I know I have the fairy in a bottle, but... Come on, don't be like that, man. You're the last battle before the the last resting site, aren't you? Yeah, asshole. Okay, let's get rid of the Caltrops. Let's use Terror, Flash of Steel. This one, Finesse. Okay. One more. We just have to resist one more attack. Let's see, if I use Dexterity, that's going to be 14, and 14, that's 28, and 14, that's 42. And if I use this instead, it's going to be 33. Oof. Well, it's better than nothing. I could also just use the block. That helps. Every little bit helps. Well, thanks to the Phantograph, I can, you know, go to the final battle with full hell, but still, that was almost totally unnecessary. 
Uh, well, thank you, Phantograph. I only have like six or seven more HP to waste before we didn't get full HP in this battle. Okay, now we have to think. Which card do I want to play twice in this battle and when? My first idea will be to use footwork, but that will be right after he evolves or he awakens. As you will have it, or use the cultural, but he doesn't hit multiple times. Okay, die, die, die is not too bad. Let's start with that. Like, these guys don't worry me as much. I could even, like, just go ahead and use at least one footwork since it's already here. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, this is not a skill. This is a power. We have to be careful with that. We really need that apotheosis. Ooh. Yeah. An extra terror, so we can save this terror for the other form. Yeah, that's nice. Oh, wow, really? I'm gonna get a Potusis on my final hand, aren't I? Well, at least I have these cards. Yeah. Oh, wow, game, what an asshole. Like, really, gang, there was no need for you to be such an asshole. Come on, I'm close. Uh, yeah, this kills it. That way I can use this and he doesn't get the power up. Okay, here we go. Phase two. Well, we're not gonna need this strike, that's for sure. But we're... Yeah, we have the, the blur, so that's fine. We can neutralize it also. Now we can use this and just keep the madness. Okay, I, I think we can make it. Now, now I'm feeling like extremely positive about it.
Oof, a void car. We can discard it, but I already explained why that is, that's a bad idea. Because it doesn't disappear. Okay, now we can use the duplicate potion and get double footwork. And also double madness. No, actually double caltrops. What am I saying? Now, I didn't remember this guy attacking multiple times, but it seems he does, so... There we go. Just look at that, that's pretty good defense. <laughs> can you imagine just keeping the void? Um, oh yeah, let's discard one of these. We can still live another day, so I don't really worry too much about my HP. Oof. Uh, okay, I'm gonna discard that one because I don't want to lose that much energy. Oh! <laughs> yeah, I had a bad feeling about that, but whatever. Uh, oh, under an hour, and we didn't use—we didn't have to use the fairy in a bottle. Oof. Well, I'm finally done with Ascension. Then I was gonna—I was planning on recording more episodes today, but yeah, no, I'm gonna better record something else. I'm just like spent from all of this late spire. Mystery Machine, Ascension, Speedster, well, we at least did it, so yay! Okay, that's going to be it for this episode, so anyways, enjoy the video, leave a like, have something to say, comment down below, one more, please subscribe, if this video ending, you can bet it is, so I thank you so much for watching, goodbye.